enjoy today's special guest. Take it away, Max. All right, let's get into it. Starting us off at the number five spot, we have Tompkins Alex on Cassidy. He's making his way to the enemy bases. His teammates just lost a fight in the mid lane. John is going to be the sole survivor. However, she's going to be playing a crucial role in distracting the red team from Alex. Going for the specter. He just needs to take down this inhibitor. And the Nexus is wide open. Ari and Blitzcrank are going to be the only ones to successfully go back on the defense. Alex opens with a ripwalk, flashes the grab and the charm, and starts working on the Nexus. Remember, that's a level three ripwalk on a two second cooldown. He's going back and forth, working on the Nexus. He gets charmed on the last one. He's super low, but he ripwalks across it just before getting grabbed. Takes down the Nexus. At our number four spot, we have I'm New on Victor. He's coming into a team fight, drops the death rate into the Chaos Storm, and takes it out. The Cypher Power auto attack is trying to see if he can get anything else. He sees Nami, throws a death ray at her, and dodges the bubble. He knows it's not going to happen. Comes back around. Nautilus flashes in to his own death. He's going to be going down behind him. He's going to be bursting down Lux. He drops the ignite, but she's going to be saved by Nami. Evan Flo. Rengar gets held down by the gravity field as I'm New flashes away. Tidal Wave comes out. That's not going to be landing. But check out Siphon Power's movement speed. 30%. He's just out kiting them right now. Bull is not going to be landing. He dodges that one. Takes Rengar down. He's going to be coming back in. Takes Slut down with the death ray. Gets the double kill. Dodges the bubble. Here comes Bolly Bear to help out in the trip. Challenger and Mad Life Enthusiast Luminum at the number three spot. Planes trash. And the enemy jungle takes down the other one. Walks the ward and sees Tristana. Flashes and grabs her with the death sentence. Planer as well. Active. Baiting the ass with last breath, successfully baiting them to death. However, Stunner's walking up is now beset. Luminum knows this. He sets up the death sentence and grabs her out of midair. Getting Gragas to kill Drana, trying to get away as well. She gets body slammed. And Luminum brings her back with another death sentence. But it doesn't end there, folks. Varys is on the side of Luminum. Sees this. He's going to be charging the bow as he grabs it with the hook line and sinker. Bringing a ribbon along for the ride. With the power of two, they pick up the kill. Our second play is going to be going to Leonidas, 159 on Yasuo. Him and his teammates are defending this first tier turret in the mid lane right now. We see Zach send up for the last thing. He misses. Twisted Fate hits him with the gold card. Leeson walks up. Dragon rages him into his whole team into a five-man last breath, getting Leo the instant triple kill. He wants the Penta. He's going to be dashing for it. He takes down Zach. Bane's on the run right now. She doesn't want to give up the Penta. Leeson flashes, hits her with the Tempest, and allows Leo to get the penta kill. Let's take a look at that one again. Here we go. The full card holding down Zach in the front line. Gets Dragon Rage into the team and a nice two shot barrage snipe from Ezreal as well. And the number one spot is going to be going to OG Junkie on Poppy. He's doing his best to stop the red team from taking the dragon right now. He has to wait for Gangplank to teleport in for the 5v5, but it's going to be too late. The red team acquire the dragon. Gangplank's there though. Junkie knows this. He wants to fight now, but the red team's trying to disengage. He's sticking on their back, flashes in, sets up the five man keeper's verdict into the cannon barrage and the whirling death from Draven. Malphite tries to get away, flashes over the wall, but it's followed up by Draven and Gangplank. Gangplank with the parlay picks up the kill. And with the long respawn timers, they're going to migrate to the top lane and start working on this inhibitor turret. OG Junkie, though, walks in. He's setting up for the play. He stuns her with a heroic charge. Lissandra hits the Zonia, so they move over to Janna. Poor Janna gets taken down while Lissandra ice prisons herself, but she's going to be going down as well. Rengar picks up the ace. They're going to be taking down this inhibitor and working on the Nexus turrets. Lucian's up, Malphite's up, and Lee Sin, but it's not good enough because of the Keeper's verdict from OG Junkie. They won the game. 